Software license management is crucial for smooth business operations. But is your organization getting the most of software license management? Time for Software License Management 101. One of the most important fields in IT asset management, software license management involves documenting, tracking, controlling, and right-sizing the software licenses of your company. SLM is used by companies with a growing software portfolio to monitor and maintain various licenses and entitlements they own, providing visibility over the company's vital license information, including limitations, availability, usage, versions, and expiration. There are five types of software licenses based on restrictiveness. There's public domain, lesser general public license, permissive, copyleft, and proprietary. Most end users are familiar with proprietary licenses, which allow users to use the software applications based on terms and conditions expressed in the end user license agreement, or EULA. To protect their proprietary software products, developers and vendors offer a number of licensing models, including standalone, which are bound to a system or a user, network-based, where licenses are deployed from a licensed server, which manages the checkout and check-in of licenses from the available license pool, and cloud, where licenses are deployed via the internet. In some instances, the application itself is accessed via the internet through Software as a Service, or SaaS. However, the number of licensing models continues to increase as software vendors introduce new ways of selling licenses based on current trends and market demands. Among these are Perpetual, where users purchase a software once and use it into perpetuity. Concurrent, where licenses are purchased in bulk to multiple users under a single licensing code. Floating, which is shared among a group of users and has set limitations on the use of the licenses. Metered, which limits one's access to software based on specific criteria. Subscription-based, where access to the software application ends after a defined period unless the subscription is renewed. Named user, license is locked to a specific user but may be installed on a limited number of devices. Node locked, where the license is locked to one or more hardware devices, allowing any users of the software to use it. Dongle, which utilizes USB ports to activate software applications, making it more portable and easier to share among various users. Paper use, which is usually used on top of concurrent licenses. Paper use or usage-based licenses are built by the vendor based on the features or products that were actually used by the user in a specific time frame. Token-based, where the user buys a number of tokens, which may then be used to access specific products and features. Each feature or application has a cost, usually expressed in tokens per user. When used, that cost in tokens will be deducted from the global token pool. These are just the most basic things you need to know about software license management. Watch our next video and discover the benefits SLM can offer your organization as well as the risk of not putting in a software license management plan. Connect with an OpenIT Business Solutions Consultant today.